Jimmy Thang from Maximum PC here at Cooler Masters CES 2014 booth. I'm here speaking with uh, Jonathan. Hi, Jimmy. And uh, Jonathan, what are we uh, taking a look at here? Well, we're looking at the uh, half stacker, but actually this year we're going to be adding to the ecosystem, providing new uh, options and accessories, including a side window, um, optical drive, a slim optical drive adapter, as well as providing more storage options and including accessory kits. Okay, cool. And then this is the, the new window. So we've seen the half stacker before. Um, this is something that's new here though, right? Yes, completely new. Okay, and then you said you have the optical drive that you can sort of uh, install, I believe you said right here? Yes, you'll have an optical drive slim accessory kit. You can in draw, install the slim slot in drive if you'd like. And a lot of people like that because it saves space and it's more elegant. Cool, so you just pop it out and then... Pop it out and put it in there. And we can also mention that we'll be including a second power switch option on our future half 935 options. Cool. And when are these modifications, uh, this new... Uh... Well, the accessory kit should be available in quarter one, it's February to January, as well as we're going to do a phase-in on the power switch on the half 935 sometime in quarter one and quarter two. Cool. All right. What else do we have here? Well, this is something brand new. It's our Project Half XC. We don't have a complete name for it. We have a full tower size chassis, and we shrunk it down into the smallest possible shape. Um, on the inside, you can see that it has eight expansion slots, a full uh, EATX motherboard tray. But on the outside, we have a fully glass wraparound window. This uh, prototype is acrylic, but we're looking at having a glass wraparound window. It allows you to see your system from the front, and a new type of 3D mesh. This mesh allows for better airflow and more elegance. Hmm. And we're going to be featuring this mesh on more of our Cooler Master products in the future. Gotcha. How, uh, what are the dimensions of this? Well, uh, you can see it's about 18 inches in wide and about 22 inches by 22 inches. About a square. Gotcha. Yeah, it's definitely a really unique looking chassis. Almost a um, uh, fish tank-ish in a way. Well, our chassis is a, has a unique ability. If you want, you can actually rotate it, and it works both ways. So oh, I see. So you can lay it down like that. Rotate the vessel and lay it down, and you can use it in a traditional test bench. Cool. And then uh, release date and pricing? Release date and pricing is TBA, but we're probably thinking about a late quarter two. Cool. Launch. And then uh, got a little smaller guy down here, I see. Yes, this is the Elite 110. This is a 15 liter chassis, and it's the smallest chassis that will be available to support the full size components. So, what you're looking at here is MITX um, with support for 120 millimeter radiator, uh, that's water cooling, and power supply, a full ATX power supply, um, a graphics card, a double slot graphics card. What's the uh, the size limitation on it? Size limitation is 8.26 inches. Okay, so it's kind of smaller, smaller graphics card. Yeah, smaller graphics card. Okay. Um, the top has actual filter design. The front is filtered. Power supply, power su switch is illuminated. Uh, everything is filtered. The pricing on this should be around fifty dollars. Oh, okay. So, and uh, do you guys have a release date? Or? Release date is the first week of Jan. Oh, this week, next oh. week. <laughs> awesome. Yes. Cool. So it should be available right now. All right. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you. Jim.